Hi, good afternoon. This is the Phoenix from Phoenix Rising Tarot. I'm here this evening to do the reading for the sign of Aries for the month of April 2019. Happy birthday to all you Aries that are in this month of April. Um, if you would like to have a private reading with me, the link would be in the description box below. Um, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share these videos. And well, let's jump into the read. Let's see what's happening for the month of April for the sign of Aries. Just remember, it's not, it's a general reading. It's not going to resonate with everyone. Take what resonates and what doesn't resonate, just leave it. Another Aries will probably resonate with it. Okay. So, let's jump in. Did he spread? Okay. So, the energy under the deck is the world in reverse. And your energies for this read is the lovers in reverse. I don't know if you could see that. Ten of Wands, upright. Crossing it is the Queen of Cups. Then we have the Emperor. Then we have the Queen of Swords. Then the Six of Wands. Then we have the Ace of Cups. The Nine of Wands in reverse. The Chariot in reverse. Page of Wands. And the Tower in reverse. <clears throat> okay. So, um, okay, let's start with the Lovers in reverse. Um, this supposed to be about finding love, being in love, being with a partner, making a decision, and then there is a ten of wands. Whatever this decision is supposed to be, it's heavy, it's a burden, it's hard, it's, it's, it's just too much. And then, be it male or female, we have the Queen of Cups. This is a queen that is in control of her emotions. She knows what she wants, she is calm. And if she offers something, she knows exactly what she's offering. She's offering love. This could be Pisces, Scorpio. It's a water sign. Then we have the Emperor. This is somebody that is in authority. This person has mastered his art. He is strong in his decision making. He has gone through it all. He stands 
courageous in whatever decision he needs or wants to make. This Queen of Swords is a queen that knows what she's wa what she wants. She is stern in her decisions. She is upright. She will make the decision to cut anything out that is no longer serving her. Then it's the Six of Wands. The Six of Wands is about victory, it's about winning, it's about just finally getting a win in your armor, in your, in the game, in whatever it is you're going to have a win in the month of April. <clears throat> and then we have the Ace of Cups. The Ace of Cups is a brand new beginning in love. So, we know that something new and fresh is coming your way. We had this lover here, this decision here, that was heavy. It was burdensome. But, you have stepped into your own power and a new cup of love is coming to you. A new beginning. Fresh love. It's all in timing. As the different moon cycles, yeah, this cup, this cup of love is coming to you. Then we have the Knight of Swords. Nine of Swords, sorry. This is, and it's in reverse. So all your battles, all your stress, everything you fought for. This Nine of Wands, I would look at it like nine steps you took on that staircase. And there is just one more to reach 10 to complete a cycle but it's in reverse so <clears throat> excuse me it's it's where you want to be you want it to be over but the energy right now it's about fighting it's about holding your ground it's about that one one that you are holding on to because the, nine be the, the eight behind you is already set in place. This one you're holding on to is the one you need to set in place to move on to the next one, to completion, to complete the cycle. Then we have the chariot in reverse. There is no movement here. You're not moving. You're not deciding, you're not, it, it, it feels like you just stopped. You stopped wanting, you stopped needing, you stopped trying to make a decision, you just stopped. But then we have the page of wands. This is a passionate message that is coming into you, Aries, for the month of April. It is a younger energy. It is pages are about messages. Um, ones is about passion. So it's a passionate message coming into you, offering you this cup of love. So... Although you're undecided and you're not making any movements, it seems that this offer is still coming your way. And then we have the tower in reverse. The tower in reverse is about 
your foundation being shaken. It's about the universe intervening and bringing your foundation down. But it's in reverse. So, I would say that the tower moment has passed. Though it's going to come, it's not going to hit you as hard as if it's in the upright. Because it's in the reverse. It's going to come, but it's going to come like... How to put it? It's not going to hurt as bad. It's not going to hurt as bad. So... What I could tell you is that whatever the situation is that you are in where this love that you had before seems to be unrequited and you have been offering this love and it's just not happening. Something new is coming in because I'm not seeing anybody from the past. This is new, fresh love. This is a new beginning. This is you having a win. You finally having a win. And yeah, you want the truth. You want to stand in your own truth. Let me get some clarifiers for these. Clarify the levels in reverse first. Show me what I need to see. Okay, the lovers reverse is clarified by the devil. This person could have an addiction, they could be a control freak, they could be a Capricorn, they could be narcissistic. But this love is toxic. It is. I'm sorry, but it is. Clarify the ten of ones for Aries for the month of April. Clarify the ten of ones for Aries for the month of April. Clarify the ten of ones. Too much cards. Clarify the ten of ones for Aries for April 2019. We have the Ten of Swords reverse. This burden that you are thinking is a burden, it's in your mind. This is about your own consciousness. This is about you being in your head. You felt that betrayal, but it's over because it's in reverse. So you have finally let go of this Ten of Swords energy and this burden, just let it go. It's done. It's gone. <clears throat> Clarify the Queen of Cups with Aries for the month of April 2019. Clarify the Queen of Cups for Aries. For April 2019, it's clarified with the Empress in reverse. This Queen of Cups is stuck. 
she's offering her cup. She wants love. She wants to be decisive. She wants to stand in her own power. But it's in her head. She can't move from being this queen and being in this energy and having all these emotions and being able to master herself because she's stuck in her head about a relationship that is toxic or a relationship that with that is with a Capricorn. That love, that decision. It, it's, it's just that it's, it's a decision that you have to make. Okay, so we have the Emperor here in reverse and we have the Emperor upright here. So, it's a couple. It's a couple. It's, 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 it's a couple that is not seeing eye to eye. She's in the reverse. He's in the upright. It could be male or female. You could be... Um, she could be the emperor, he could be the empress. The energies could reverse. It could it could be you, it could be a female, it could be a male. But this is a couple here. But it's a toxic relationship. It has you in your head. It hurts that you are now coming out of that pain. But you need to release this before you could become upright in this empress energy. This emperor, he knows his stuff. He knows what he's doing. He's, he knows what he's about. He knows what he wants, where he wants to go, what he wants to do. He's ready. He's ready. He's, he's ready. He, he knows what he wants. He's so ready. Clarify the emperor. For Aries, for April 2019, we have the Seven of Pentacles. Get it. This is about planting a seed. It's about waiting for the fruit to come into fruition. It's it's where you toil is where you plant the seed you water it you nourish it you you pay attention to it because you're waiting you're waiting it's, it's divine timing you just need to hang on and wait just a little while longer it's coming it's coming okay okay so the Queen of Swords is clarified by the Tree of Pentacles. The Tree of Pentacles is about a partnership. It's about uh, starting a business. It's about cooperation. This Tree of Pentacles with this Queen of Swords is telling me that once you stand in this power and you are not indecisive, you know what you want. You know you've cut away the lies. You know you're standing in your truth. This will be offered. Companionship. It would be a, a, a start to a new company, a new contract, a new job. Or it could mean a third party relationship. Yeah, because there are three people here. There is the Queen of Cups, the Emperor, and we have the Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords, sorry. So for some of you, this is a third party relationship. This Queen of Cups could be Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. This Queen of Swords energy, sorry, could be Libra. It's the air sign. Alright. Um, yeah, it could be a third party situation that's toxic. 
one person is having two people here and it's toxic it's just toxic there is just some kind of addiction uh, you could be in your head about this you you can't move on you want to be a couple but you are you are both on opposite sides of one another you wanted to become flirtatious but no it's just I don't know too many people in our relationship okay Spirit clarify the Ace of Cups. Who is this Ace of Cups? Ace of Cups could be Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. It's 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 a new beginning in love. Ah, we have the magician here, and it's in the upright. So you have what it takes. To manifest this couple of this couple of that you're looking for you have what it takes to manifest this yeah it's there you have all that you need and the divine helping you to manifest this is of cups this new beginning in life Yeah. Wow. This third party doesn't always have to be another person. It could be an addiction. But for here, it's three outstanding energies. So for some of you, it is a third party situation. For others of you, it's an addiction. But it's it's weighing on your mind heavily. It's it's confusing. It's tiring. You know you want to give up. You know you planted the seed. You're waiting for the fruits, but it's not coming. It's not coming. It's 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 just not coming. But remember, you have what it takes. To manifest this cup of love. Clarify the nine of wands for Aries, April 2019. Okay, it's for it's it's clarified with the six of pentacles in reverse. This situation is not an equal give and take. It's one person doing all the work. This nine of wands, it's just, it's it's passion that only one person is giving. The other person is just receiving. It's not an equal give and take. It's just one person. It's just one person. Clarify the chariot in reverse for Aries for April 2019. Clarify the chariot in reverse for the sign of Aries, April 2019. The chariot is is clarified by the chariot in reverse. So the both cards are in reverse. So there is no movement. You don't want to move. You don't want to make a decision. You don't want to get rid of the situation you you're still having hope you're thinking that you could manifest this you could manifest ending the third party and so you're stuck you're stuck because it's the chariot card reverse clarified by the chariot card reverse spirit Clarify the two chariot cards reverse. Oh. Yeah. It's clarified with the nine of swords. It's all in your head. You have the power to let it go and move on. But you're not doing that. It's all in your mental. 
It's keeping you up at night. This is this third party situation that is toxic. You don't want to move. You, 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 it, it looks like you don't want to move on from it. It's not an equal give and take. It has you in your head. You just stop. Clarify the page of ones for Aries. For April 2019. You have the hermit. Yeah, I hope you all could see this. You have the hermit. <clears throat> the hermit is clarifying the page of ones. So, you are going to be receiving a message of passion. But you're doing nothing about it. You're going into the hermit mode. You're going within yourself. You're looking for answers. You're trying to illuminate your own way. So this page of wands, this message you're getting, is going to take you within you. It's going to take you to find answers for yourself. Spirit, clarify the tower in reverse of Aries for the month of April 2019. Clarify the tower in reverse for Aries for April 2019. It's clarified with the Ace of Pentacles. Wow. The Ace of Pentacles is about a new beginning. It's about a stable new beginning. It is, yeah, this tower moment here, it, it, it's not going to hit you as hard, but it is going to be a new beginning for you. You are going to have some kind of solid new start. This could be a business. It could be a new job. It could be money. It could be all those things. That was nice. That was nice. Um... Okay, so Spirit, clarify the Six of Wands in the upright position for Aries for the month of April 2019. Clarify the Six of Wands. Clarify the Six of Wands. This is the present. This is the present. Clarify the Six of Wands, this victory. Oh. <clears throat> yeah. You're going to have victory because you're going to have choices. You're going to have choices. Or this could be confusion for the ones that are in this situation. For the ones that are in this situation where it's just toxic, it's just, it's just, hurting it's just you, you know this could be confusion or for some of you it could be victory in having choices you could have choices this month choices that would be concerning the ace of cups it could be choices concerning whatever this Ace of Pentacles is. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Sorry. Clarify the Seven of Cups for the Aries oh. for April 2019. Clarify the Seven of Cups for Aries for April 2019. Oh! It's been clarified with the page of cups. This page could be a water sign. Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. 
this page of cups is an offer of love. Yeah. So to clarify your many options or whatever the confusion is for some of you, you're going to get an offer of love. And that page ties in with this Ace of Cups that you are manifesting. Sorry if you didn't see that. So some of you are manifesting this love. And it's coming. You're going to get it in the form of a message. Pages are messengers. And you're going to have plenty of options with this new love. And it's going to be victorious because these are the cards that clarify the six of wands. Yeah, you're going to be victorious. When this page of cups comes, you're going to have a lot of options. Oh. Um, let me see if I could possibly try to um, help clarify this situation here. Um, Spirit, clarify the Tree of Pentacles. Clarify the Tree of Pentacles. Yeah, it's, 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 it feels like a third party situation. Spirit, clarify the Tree of Pentacles. Or Aries, or the month of April. It's been clarified with the King of Pentacles. Somebody's coming in. I'm telling you, even if you are in a third party situation, this is new love. This is the Ace of Cups that you're manifesting. You are manifesting this. Let go of this. Something new, something stable. Somebody that probably has money, a manager, a, a owner of a company. Somebody is coming in to you. Somebody that is not flaky. Somebody that is not this. This is the lover's card in reverse. And this is the devil. This is an addiction. It's a toxic love. It's a toxic relationship. Let it go. And then you had, I'm going to clarify the ten of swords in reverse here. <sighs> With the ten of wands. It, it's two tens. It's two tens. It's the end of a cycle. That cycle needs to end. It's closing off cycles. It's two tens. It doesn't get any more better than this. This relationship is toxic. A victory is waiting on you. But you need to bring this around to a close. It's ten. It's two ten. It's a ten of wands and a ten of swords. Spirit. Clarify the ten of swords. The ten of wands for Aries for the month of April. See? If you don't close off this cycle, if you don't leave this toxic relationship, yeah, this six of swords is in reverse. You're not going to move to calmer waters. You're not going to have a peace of mind. This is in reverse. You need to make that decision. You need to put down this load. You need to get out of your head. You need to take this move. You need to move on to calmer waters. <sighs> Clarify the Empress in reverse for Aries. April 2019 clarify the Empress for the Aries for April 2019 it's clarified with the Tree of Cups are you seeing this this is a celebration this is happiness this is yeah it could also mean a third party again another tree but if you let go of this you'd find happiness let go of the third party relationship 
clarify the seven of pentacles for aries for the month of april 2019 clarify the seven of pentacles for aries for april 2019 yeah yeah you could be happy alone this is the nine of pentacles i hope you're seeing it yeah you could be happy alone you don't need this come on you don't need to be in a toxic relationship you don't need to be in a third party relationship you could be just as happy independent have all your coins in order this is about being single yeah this could be you and it, you could be very happy but you had to make the choice clarify the six of pentacles in reverse aries for the month of april 2019 clarify oh. it's been clarified with the queen of cups yeah the same queen here this could be your energy this could be you stepping into this energy this could be someone coming to you offering you their love because in this situation look at it it's nine of wands and six of pentacles both reverse you understand there is no work there is no equal give and take but then you have the queen of cups scorpio pisces cancer they could be coming towards you offering you this cup this is a queen of cups she knows what she wants she is not undecisive she is not this no she knows what she wants and she's coming towards you <clears throat> Clarify the Nine of Swords energy for Aries for April 2019. Clarify the Nine of Swords. Huh. You have the Emperor again. You have the Emperor again. After all this mental anguish, look at it. After this non movement, and all this mental anguish yeah time for you to step into your own power this is you this is you Aries be it male be it female you need to step into your own power so stop being undecisive stop not wanting to make a move once you make a move and you get out of your head you're going to come into your own power leave it alone some things you just need to walk away from clarify the hermit for aries for the month of april 2019 clarify the hermit for aries for the month of april 2019 okay it's been clarified with the Knight of Wands. This could be your energy. You're not moving. This could be you. This could be somebody, another fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, that isn't coming into you. There is no fast movements. There is no passion. So even when you soul search, I don't see it. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for Aries for April 2019. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for Aries for April month. <laughs> yeah, for the ones that I'm talking to, for the ones that has gotten out of this toxic situation as and has made up their mind and has come out of these um 
in your head and type of energies. You're using your intuition for that ace of pentacles. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it, people. This is the ace of pentacles. And this is the high priestess. This is you using your intuition and you moving forward and you leaving all of this behind. Yeah. Let's clarify the magician for Aries for the month of April 2019. Yeah. I bought up my spirits a bit. You have the four of cups. You're bored. You're tired. You're fed up. And this is clarifying the magician. And this ace of cups. These are wonderful cards. Are you looking at the lunar cycle? It's all in divine timing. Yeah, you could manifest it. But you're getting bored. Because the universe is offering you a cup. But you're not seeing it because you're concentrating on the tree that is before you. See this? See this, Aries? Are you, are you looking at this? Yeah. If you're manifesting love, don't get bored. Don't think it's not coming. It's just in divine timing. It's, it's going to come. This offer is going to come. But for some of you that is in this toxic relationship, you need to get out of this, out of this third party, uh, whatever this heavy energy is, and move in. And this, this would be all you. So that's all I got for you for the month of April. Happy birthday to whose birthday it is this month. Hope it resonated. Take whatever resonated, what didn't. Leave it, somebody else would be able to get it. Have a blessed day.